Hello everybody, good day to you all. Today I am talking about the Latin trailer, the Latin teaser trailer. The movie's been directed by Guy Ritchie. After starring in it are um, Mina Massad, I think I say his name. Massad, Massad. Um, Naomi Scott, Will Smith, and Marwin Kanzari. And, okay, the, first of all, we all seen, we all seen this little teaser trailer. We all seen the trailer, and it, it doesn't look good. It doesn't look good at all. There's a lot of things, there's a lot of things wrong with it. This, first of all, this movie has a huge hurdle to overcome. The original Latin movie was iconic. It was a great movie. It, it touched and influenced so many things. It's it, it part of our culture. It, it inspires so many people who saw this person when they were young. And so now this movie has a huge, huge hole to fill. I mean, from the voice acting from Robin Williams to the animation that still holds up to the day. The music, the songs, I mean, it has so many iconic things to it. And this this movie right here has to come in at 100. If not, it's going to fail. Anything below 100, it's going to fail. It's going to, it's going to be considered a failure. It has to be. And so, I'm watching this I'm watching this trailer, and a lot of people are focused on Will Smith and how he looks. Okay, I get that. Everybody's decided to see the genie. They, everybody got everybody got a original Latin in their head. And they see Will Smith. He doesn't look good. He really doesn't. The, the CGI and the and the in the in, in, um in the human being combining thing doesn't work. It's not, we're not there yet. Or maybe we are. It's not, here's the thing. I don't understand. I don't know where we are in CGI wise. I really don't know because I can watch um, some movies like Planet of the Apes. I can watch that movie and say, Oh my God, those apes look so real. Oh my God, it's amazing. Then I go watch something like um, Ant Man and the Wasp, and watch my, I watch they watch the age Michael Douglas, and I say, "Oh my God, this is amazing! It looks fantastic!" And then I watch this and I just, what happened? This movie looks cheap. It looks cheap. It looks, like, it looks like they didn't want to pay the money. Either they know this movie's going to flop, and they don't care because it is Disney. I mean, they probably don't care because they're, they're going to make a lot of money this year. They got so many movies coming out. So what, my movie flops for them like this. Whatever, tax write off. I don't care. We just did it for charity. They don't, it's, they don't give a rat's butt. I mean, so, so you got the whole Will, Will, Smith, the whole Will Smith thing. Looks kind of weird. Jafar, the the, person, the, the guy who's um, who's um, playing Jafar, he might be a great actor. I don't know, but when you hear his voice, you 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 better just, what happened. Like he sound like a child. Like just why is his voice so high pitch? Is he, he Javar would be intimidating. Put me kind of scary a little bit. I'm, I'm not scared of him when he start talking. And they don't and they don't show any personality from from Jasmine or Latin. And Latin was just like like this street smart kid, kind of um charming. Has a sense of humor to him as well. But you kind of like him. You like him as well, even though he was in a, like a poor status. But he was very charming and like that too. You got to win you over, even though he had no money. And and Jasmine was like strong and smart and independent. But like you know, like like I said, because we probably see, we might see this in the movie, but we don't see it in the trailer. We don't get the personalities at all. Not everybody seemed kind of bland. Only person that should see the personality is it's Will Smith, and the messed up part is no one likes how he looks. So there's this oh, I mean there are good things about this trailer that look fantastic. Like the, the whole scene when you saw all the colors and the little parade going going on um, Acrobat. It's mostly like it's gonna be the Prince Ali thing. Looked great. Jasmine looked good in her um, in, in the costume that she was. She's a beautiful girl, but. The CGI is still a little weak. It's not that great. It could get better as the time goes on. I don't know. Will Smith, like I said, the, the, the mismatch between CGI and how he really looks didn't quite not work quite working. See, here's the thing. I don't. My personal opinion is I don't think they should have tried to make it look like this, the original um, uh, um, genie at all. I don't think they should have went blue. I don't think they should have even tried to touch it. Like, leave that alone. Don't, leave, it, it, it happened already. We're going we're gonna to do our own thing. I, I liked how he looked on the cover of that magazine when he had him in his human form. I liked how he looked then. I think, I, I think, it, it, should, I should, I think it should have made him stick throughout the whole entire movie. That's just how he looks. I don't think they should have tried to make him blue because it it, I don't think it's going to work. Because you, either you got to go full CGI and have, have both Smith do the voice or try to blend or, or, or go human. 
But this whole mismatch thing, no. Now, do I think this is the worst trailer I've seen, ever seen in my life? No. Do I think, do I want to gouge out my eyeballs because I saw this? No. Is Will Smith going to give me nightmares? No. Why would he give me nightmares? What are people talking about? It's not that bad. I mean, it's not good, but it's not that bad. This whole trailer is just a C. It's a C-level trailer. It's not the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. Ain't the best thing either. This doesn't really get me excited. It's just, it's just, it's just average. It's just an average trailer. That's all it is. There's nothing special about it. Here's because like I said before, this movie has to come in at a hundred. Anything lower than a hundred is a fail. This movie came in at a, at a C, but with the confidence. Of, but this thing, this is a C level trailer, but it has the confidence of a of a hundred of an A level trailer. I just like. You, and, and then I expect everybody else to get on board. And then, and, and then we've seen them, and it's like, no, 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 we're not. But I don't hate this trailer. I don't hate it. I don't love it either. Like I said, it's just a C. It's just, it's, just, it's just a C level. That's it. That's all it is. Hopefully the movie's good. I'm, I'm, I'm still going to go see this. I'm still going to go see it in the theaters. I'm still going to be excited for it. I, I want to be, I hope my mind, hope my mind get blown away. And if, it's, if it sucks, oh well, it just sucks. It is what it is. Next movie. Because we got... Because Disney got The Lion King. We got um, Dumbo, which looks amazing. Um, you got um, Avengers, Spider-Man Homecoming. I mean, they're, they're fine. This might, this might take a hit. Or not. Let's see where it goes. Let's see how this goes. And we can go to the theater, right? We can go to the theater and it comes out. And it's oh my gosh, it was so beautiful. Or we can say, this thing does suck. And this is pretty much how it is. It's like, oh well. Just got to keep moving forward. That's all, we, that's all we can do. So, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about the, the Aladdin teacher trailer. Or trailer. Or whatever this is. Did you think it was the worst thing you've seen in your life? Did it give you nightmares? Or is this thing, eh, it's just alright. It's alright. Or, or... That's pretty, much, that's pretty much it. Yeah. That's pretty much. So, like I said, if you have seen it, leave your comments down below. If you haven't seen it, you're kind of curious, want to see what the whole fuss is about, check it out for yourself. Hopefully, maybe you watch it. You might enjoy it. You might think it's the best thing ever. Who knows? So, pretty much, pretty much all I got to say about that. So, give my channel a big like, hit the thumbs up, shaboop, and subscribe to my channel and share. I would appreciate it, like I always say, in my dreams, in my life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, people.